Hello everyone, in this video, I'm gonna show you how we can create 3D game in MIT Apple Mentor with the help of AI. So here we go. First of all, open the MIT Apple Mentor platform, ai2.appleventor.mit.edu. Now here we need to click on the new project and my project name is Game 3D. And okay, here you can see this is a first screen. Okay, now I'm gonna just drag and drop here one layout, click on the layout. And just drag and drop the vertical arrangement like this and make that alignment and the alignment vertical and the horizontal should be centered and make this height and width is fill parent like this. Now click on the layout again here, user interface, and just drag and drop one button here and make sure that button, okay, that button name is a start king or play something, okay. I'm gonna make that is like around the font size is like 30, like this. And I'm gonna, I, I wanna change the background color of this. So make background color something. So I'm gonna use that background color. So this is our first screen of our game. I have just changed the background color of our vertical arrangement and the button background color. Now, whenever someone click on that button, so our game should start. So what I'll do here, I'm gonna just hide that arrangement and I'm gonna add one new arrangement here, okay? So vertical arrangement, I'm gonna just drag and drop it and make that hide and with this fill parent same as like this. And I'm gonna just click on the block section and whenever someone click on that button, so or mean that vertical arrangement should visible off, okay? That should be false. And the another arrangement, it means another one is two, that should be visible true like this okay so i'm gonna just make sure like this now what we need to do here make sure click on user interface and just drag and drop here the back view like this that's it now i'm gonna just make that is visible off and make that uh, word management visible off okay now we have a back view whenever i click on this so layout should visible okay true should be visible and that going to be a height now we need to use here the AI. So here I'm going to use the Grok AI. So open the Grok AI, grok.com, Grok AI, and just type here, create a 3D cube game with multi-level functionality. Have some colorful cubes. So create that game in single white using HTML, CSS, and JS. Okay. Now we need to wait some second and that AI will give us our code, okay? And we are gonna add this game in Apple Mentor. So I'm gonna just copy that code, open the any code editor, click on new file, and just paste that code and save that file in desktop. 3 dgamehtml I'm gonna just open that file and let's see how that will perform. Okay, so here this is the game. Let me just try. Oh, here you can see, wow, that's really fantastic game. But as you can see here, uh, I need to play with this game using the keyboard, right? So how can I play? Oh, it's game over. Okay. Now, how can I play that game in mobile? Okay. So let's go to the here and just say here, please update that code to play in mobile phone. Use Fencer or something or add key. So let's see that will update the code for me. So as you can see here, I updated version of 3D Cube game, optimized for a mobile play. I have added the touch control and including the attempt to use the proximity sensor. So I have also added the on-screen control button as reliable uh, fallback for a mobile device. That's really fantastic. So yeah, he added the multiple things for us. So let's wait some second. Yeah, that is done. Now I'm going to just copy that code and let's paste that code in VS Code. Okay, here I'm going to just replace that code and just play again look really great fantastic it's really great so that's working right so what i'm gonna do here i'm gonna use that in the phone let's see how that will work okay so open the mit uploader in the right side you will see the upload file click on it click on choose file and now go to the desktop and you can see 3dgame.html file just upload that file and click on ok now go click on the web view in the right side you will see here this is web view and just go to the home url and just type here http column double forward slash localhost forward slash and then your file name is 3 dgamehtml 3 dgamehtml like this okay 
Now, let me just try this, how this will work on the phone. AI companion, just copy that code and open the app adventure. As you can see, this is the game. As you can see, this is the first button where you can see the start game button. Okay, this is the first screen. Now, oh, I'm going to just click on it. Okay, so once I click on it, so game will start like this. Okay, now you can see there's some arrows. Okay, so once you, you can see the score is 5 and level is 1. Now, you need to use that keys to collect these cubes. Like, you know, uh, like this. See, like this. And once you do this, so your, you know, score will increase. Like, see, 20, level 2. And uh, try this green. Yeah, that one. So, this is a really fantastic 3D game we use here, AI and the MIT App Inventor. So, this is the easiest way to create 3D game in MIT App Inventor. If you have any doubt, you can ask me and comment. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a nice day. Be safe. Bye-bye.